He was on SBS. Oh, he went on Inky Gaio? What did he do on Inky Gaio? Did he perform or really? Oh my gosh. That's crazy. 안녕하세요. 저 구박의 미국인 헤이린입니다. 3년 좀 됐어요. I graduated high school and then I came here for vacation. I came twice during high school during, but then I moved here after I graduated. <laughs> The first time I ever came to Korea I was in the summer. Compared to Texas, dude, Korea is so hot and it's like wet. So when I think back on my first vacation here, everything is just like hazy. Like everything is just hot and sweaty. Like I didn't know what I was doing. It was really fun, but I just did like the normal touristy things. I went to the river. I went to the Namsan Tower. I went to Lotte World. Like I did the... My high school friend also liked Korea. There's quite a few things, but I think most amazing thing compared to Texas is the transportation. Because in Texas, you need a car or else you cannot get anywhere. You need to get an Uber or something like that. But here, you know, buses, trains, taxis, subways, and everything is also walkable. You walk places as well. Yeah, so the friend that I came with, she was actually really into Korea and like Korean culture, even before me. I think recently, yeah, I think BTS and Blackpink blew up. Um, a lot of K-pop and K-drama influences has started in the States. A lot more people have been interested in Korea. I definitely think that the interest in Korea has risen. Today, I'm going to be looking at some Korean actors that came to Hollywood. Oh, are these Korean people? Oh, on the left, okay. The profile of the girl on the left slightly looks like Lee Hyori, but I know that's not Lee Hyori. And then the other two people, I have no idea who they are. Angelina Jolie! <laughs> oh, that's in Korea? Oh, I didn't know she came to Korea. That's very obviously Angelina Jolie tattoo face. Oh, I heard, yeah, oh, okay, 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 yeah. I heard about that. One of her kids is, is studying here, right? We still have a chance to run into Angelina Jolie. <laughs> if you asked me, like, who do I think I would run into the streets in Korea? I'd probably say a Korean idol or something like that, but Angelina Angelina Jolie is so random. Like, I don't even know what she would be doing in Korea. Well, because there's so many foreigners in Korea, but that's crazy. Oh, because usually, you know, when we see celebrities, they're usually, they're at award shows or, you know, you see their huge house on Instagram or something like that. So I think a lot of people get shocked when kind of reality hit. They are faced with the fact that celebrities are normal people. They just do random, you know, normal human stuff. A lot of people are shocked when they just see celebrities living their lives. Mm, I think that also depends on the kind of person that you are. I think Angelina Jolie is, has always been like a very open and very charitable and like friendly person. And maybe she didn't even think that people would recognize her in Korea, honestly. I don't even know if she walks around with bodyguards usually. I'm not sure, but either way, and also like Korea is a pretty safe country. I wanted to go back to Korea from the first day I came back to Chicago where I used to live. It took less than five minutes to know that it was not Korea after leaving at 11 p.m. due to the habit of living in Korea for two years. Life in Korea was lucky. I absolutely agree with this. Every time that I go back to visit my family in Texas, after just a week, I feel like very cooped up and like very stressed out and kind of like with nowhere to go because 10 11 p.m even sometimes 9 p.m everything is closed you can't go anywhere so i can definitely relate to this comment korea is the only country where angelina jolie can walk around without a bodyguard she is one of the most famous actors in korea that's why i can't believe it all Korean people know who Angelina Jolie is. Yeah, I, I agree that Korea is a very safe country. I don't know if she knew that. I definitely feel safer in Korea than I do in the States. Like I would never even think about walking my dogs at night in America. And I don't live in a dangerous neighborhood or anything, but here I can just more freely whenever I want to without really having to worry about someone killing me <laughs> or kidnapping me. Wouldn't he be accompanied by a bodyguard because he thought there would be a dangerous situation because he couldn't get a gun? Wonder a lot. Uh, well, not all American people own a gun. <laughs> I do agree that America is a little more dangerous than Korea, but not even about guns. There's dangerous people in all countries. I do agree that Korea is safer than America. Snoop Dogg. Show me the money. Wait, Snoop Dogg went on show me the money. I know who this is. This is Snoop Dogg. Everyone knows who Snoop Dogg is in the safe. He's like a legendary, the OG rapper, I guess. Guess he appeared on show me the money. I didn't know that. <laughs> Now that's crazy. I didn't know that happened. A lot of Korean people know who Snoop Dogg is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
All of them? Cool. Uh, but I'm a little surprised because I feel like I remember he kind of made fun of like mumble rappers or like rappers that really don't rap about anything and they just kind of like, hun, 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 like yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, So I'm a little surprised that he showed up. But you know, actually Snoop Dogg is very like cultured. So yeah, I am very surprised that he came. Usher? Oh. Oh, he went. Okay, this looks old. He was on SBS. Oh, he went on... Inky Gaio? What did he do on Inky Gaio? <laughs> did he perform or? Dude, I never even knew that in Korea. That's so random. <laughs> I guess he succeeded because he's on SBS. <laughs> I had no idea that he was on here. I had no idea Usher even like knew anything about Korea at all. No, what? <laughs> okay. Oh, well, the, the fans seem to really enjoy it. They're screaming their heads off. Depending on what year this is, it could have been a little scandalous because of like the twerking and the dancing and stuff. Um, it looks cool. <laughs> Lady Gaga. Is Lady Gaga popular in Korea? Lady Gaga is, again, everyone knows who she is. Very unique artist. She's very talented. Oh, I know that she performed in Korea. Yeah, I remember hearing a few years ago that she had a concert in Korea and stuff like that. Is Kanye West in that picture? Is that Kanye West in the center of the photo? Really? Oh my gosh. <laughs> I didn't know Kanye West came to Korea. Did he promote his stuff here? Do Korean people know who Kanye West is? Yeah, I, I doubt the owner of this restaurant knew who these guys were. Um, I mean, it looks like a normal, you know, evening out, bunch of people eating, but that's the only strange thing about this photo. <laughs> He's weird. <laughs> oh, Shaquille O'Neal. That huge dude. I really like him. He has a really good reputation. He's like this gentle giant. They must have gone crazy. I can't even imagine. You're at school and like suddenly Shaquille O'Neal walks in. What did they do with Shaquille O'Neal? Oh god, what? He was a student for a day? Did he even fit in the desk? Like, bro, I want to watch this. <laughs> Is the empty desk for him? He can get one leg in that desk. Shaquille O'Neal. Just to start off, I love Shaquille O'Neal. And the fact that he spent a whole day in a tiny desk as a Korean student just blows my mind. I have to search up this program because I'm actually really interested in seeing. I can just imagine the students just like staring at him all day. Yeah, I think that's the most like amazing one that we saw. I think um, not only was it a way for them to advertise themselves, but also to connect with other fans that they have from all parts of the world. He himself was probably interested in connecting with Korean fans, diverging into another culture you know, for these uh, celebrities. It's just an experience, I think, for themselves and for their. 오늘은 제가 한국에 온 할리우드 배우 사진을 봤는데요. 어떠셨나요? 이 영상이 좋아하면 like, subscribe. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.